Now, opening your Yale Connects Smart Lock couldn't be any easier. As well as using the app, there's the phone tags, key cards, key tags, and even virtual keys that you can send to anyone with the app. I'll leave our expert to explain it all to you and show you how it works. Before you use a card, key tag, or phone tag, you need to pair it to the lock. Start by opening the app and selecting the key you wish to add the tag to. Next, go to the lock menu and select the card slash tag option. Now select new card slash tag and give it a name. Now you will need to pair the tag or card to the lock. The app will prompt you to press the Bluetooth wake up button and the light will turn purple. You will then need to present the tag, fob or card you wish to add to the lock. Once paired, the light will turn green and the app will show you that the users have been updated. To send a virtual key, the recipient needs to have downloaded the Yale Connexus app. Once they have set up an account, click on the key you wish to share and select Manage Users. Type in the email address of the person you wish to send the key to. A yellow icon will appear next to their name to indicate they have the app. Select the user and then indicate whether you want the key to be temporary or permanent. The key will then be sent and will appear on the recipient's smartphone. They need to click on the key and press Accept. Only people paired with you on the app can open the door, and the app will keep a list of all paired and named access devices. Pretty clever stuff, don't you think? And did you know you can pair up to 50 different tags and cards, which you can buy from the Everest website, or give them a call 0800 010 123, and you'll never have to worry about losing your keys again, right? I better get going. Car keys. What are my car keys? Anyone see my car keys? Anyone?